everyone it's Karen here from interior real estate and it's Friday the 12th of June and we're right near the weekend it's right around the corner and this is the third and final video that is in this set for my sellers out there who want to know how to prepare their house and get it ready to sell during the COVID crisis well each case is going to be individual and if you're selling a home that needs major improvements or if it's a fixer-upper then the price is obviously going to reflect that but doing simple fixes around the house is a really good idea before you decide to list your home. A buyer might be put off if they're walking around seeing dollar sign after dollar sign of simple improvements that could have been made prior to listing. So there are three types of buyers. They're the ones that don't mind what you have or haven't done because they're looking for a bargain or they want to make an investment. There's the expressive buyer who's focused on the neutral colours and feel of the space or the analytical buyer who wants numbers and facts about the home. So together with Dawn and Chris, we're going to discuss how we're going to present the space to appeal to as many people as possible and attend to the areas that do need improvement. So where do they start? What are the easy fixes? Well, the obvious ones are going to be fresh paint on the walls, floor coverings, new window coverings, and these don't need to be custom made. Fixtures, taps, shower heads, shower curtains, and the landscaping is a, is a really great one. So if Chris and Dawn decide that they want to do a more extensive overhaul of their space. Then in Tiro we have a pinnacle program where a personal project coordinator will go through a list of options and costs and you pay nothing up front. You don't pay anything for the improvements until the close of escrow. So if you want to do bigger improvements and renovations such as kitchens and bathrooms and a deck addition or say you want to have a whole window replacement then Pinnacle will help you to coordinate all of the above and they'll do smaller things as well for you if you prefer and you don't need to worry about the cost until you sell your home. Now in Dawn and Chris's situation they don't need to do a whole lot so they decide to paint the walls a neutral colour and replace the floor coverings and upgrade the fixtures in the bathroom which is enough for them. Well together we also have a little talk about how to declutter the areas to give a more expansive feel as well as depersonalising the home. Now Dawn loves her doll collection and they are placed all throughout the home but this might be a distraction from the space so right now it's best to remove them. Now slowly we get through the list we make together of the do's and the don'ts that they need to attend to until the house is ready to show. Because after all, Dawn and Chris, they know that first impressions matter. Now, I know that was short and sweet, but I hope my video gave you some, a little bit of an idea on how to best present your home to sell. And if you want to get a list of a seller's checklist that you can go through for your own home, then please give me either a ping on the details above or leave a comment in the box below and I will get in touch. I want to thank you again for watching. I hope really, I really appreciate you checking in with me today and I hope you have a wonderful weekend. So stay safe out there, take care of yourself and until next time, bye for now.